Keith, I thought you were better than that. Regarding your request, Commander Kalabajui, we have heard your request to speak with the Pale Tree. She has moments of clarity, but they're unpredictable and interspersed with long periods of unconsciousness. Please, come at your convenience, but you'll have to wait until she awakens. Mender Ain of the Grove. The last thing our organization needed was additional layers of bureaucracy. So I can know where I'm going. Mordramoth has already claimed too many victims. Do you think the Pale Tree will recover? Our mother is resilient, but the Mordrum tore at her in ways we don't fully understand. We know it affected her mind. She fades in and out of awareness. But she said she was able to protect the dream from the assault. But at what cost to herself? I'm at your service. Hey there. I spoke with one of the Silvari, and she said the pale tree could wake up any time. Glad you made it when you did. Promise to let us know she wakes. Where's Casimir? She stayed in Camp Resolve to help prepare for the launch. Rox and Brom, too. Timey said she was going back to school, but you never know with that child. Good. We'll make this visit as quick as we can. Are you excited to tell the Pale Tree what you know about the egg? I am. She can perhaps help us find Kate. Let's hope so. I can tell you want to find her as quickly as possible. Something on your mind, Jory? You've been quiet. I guess I just don't understand why this egg is so important. It's an egg of a dragon. How is an egg going to help us take down Mordramoth? Dragon Egg. The Pact is ready to leave without us. Well, no killing Mordramoth means a lot to you. It killed my sister. I have to ask you to trust me. Mordramoth is one battle in a greater war. And you're certain this egg will help us win the war. Okay, boss, I'm with you. You do support, Jory. Your friendship. Thank you. Uh, someone's coming. Good news, hopefully. Friend, she's aware now. But we can never predict for how long. Follow me, please. Mother, I've brought the Pact Commander who asked to see you. Good. I was hoping to see you soon. The Vision. Have you made any progress with it? I believe so. I found the egg, but... What a relief. You may have just saved Tyria. The struggle is far from over, but if you had failed to find and protect the egg, it would have been over before it began. So, Kaith has the egg in her custody. We're trying to find her. Kaith has the egg? Why? You, you're the one who must care for it, not Kaith. That's why I gave you the vision. I know, but for some reason I don't understand. She ran off with it. Because she's Kaith. Oh. Well, you must find her. I can help, but my powers in this regard are limited. What can we do? Maybe if you knew more about her past. I can give you memory seeds. They will allow you to search her memories for places that are significant to her. Ain, please give Kalabajui four memory seeds. They reveal a slice of Kate's history to you. Among those memories, perhaps you will find something that will guide you to her. How do I use them? I'll let Ain explain them to you. I am so tired. She has all the knowledge you need. Ain, if you please. Thank Here's you very much. The first seed here in the grove. It's where Kate's roots are. Ask me if you have any other questions about them. All right. Did, 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 I get, did I get seeds? I don't have seeds. You have seeds? Marjorie, do you have seeds? Oh, there's a bar in the corner. How handy. Oh, got it. Plant memory seed. Plant seed. Here we go. I'm plant woman. Oh, please, Traherne. Don't tell me you're up here contemplating the words of a long-dead centaur. I know what you think of Ventari's tablet, but I find wisdom in it. 
Do you even consider other views? Filling the heads of this new crop with only one side doesn't seem responsible. Ventari's tenants will help them make something of themselves, my dear. All sentient beings feel that urge. Exactly. To make something of themselves, not to live up to someone else's ideal of what they should be. Case, can we talk for a moment? We sure can. After the gathering today, we must corner Wynn and get her to tell us what she was talking to Mother about. You're obsessing again. You know how we night blooms are about our secrets? This is important, Case. She knows something that could hold sway over all Silvari. That's not trivial. <laughs> you don't know that's true. You overheard a portion of a conversation out of context, no less. I know. Come on, we're going to be late for the gathering. I like gatherings. Are meeting. What do you suppose they're going to talk about? I imagine they're as surprised as we are that we awoke. Do you suppose they want us gone? Don't be ridiculous. I tried again to talk to Kiara. Seriously, why don't you just leave her be? She doesn't want company. Over two years. That's how long the others were here all alone. Just the twelve. It explains why they're so intimate with one another. I wish I'd been one of them. The elders follow without thinking. This tablet, it's a farce. They cling to it because it tells them how to behave. But we, we have our own minds. We do not swallow whole the old philosophies. We are better than that. Can you meet tomorrow night to discuss the tablet? Midnight. Hmm, I'll be there. It'll be good to speak with others of a similar mind. Thank you all for coming. We're here to discuss our newly awakened and how we can best assist them. You say assist, but you mean mold. You want to make them all into your version of good little Silvari. No. As firstborn, it is our responsibility to care for and guide these second-born. The newly awakened, let's not call them second-born, could benefit from our knowledge of Antari's tenants. Oh, please. I'd love to be an ant at their feet, to hear what they're saying. There they go again, probably talking about us. Why aren't we involved in their discussions? We can hear you, you know. It's a waste of time. These newly awakened don't need to be coddled. We didn't need anyone holding our hands or interpreting the unexamined philosophies. But they're not us. Maybe when is right, maybe we should... If we do anything, we should encourage them to think for themselves. Depend on themselves. Besides, Win can't be trusted. She keeps secrets from us. That is true. She just seemed to be hiding something. If Win knows something of import, she will tell us. Let's not change the subject, please. We're discussing the secondborn. Are she going secondborn, then? It's a terrible name for them, Traherne. And thus, we make official the chasm between them and us. We're all just so vary. We did awaken first, though. It's a terrible attitude to have. Don't look at me that way, Wynn. You know I'm right. Whatever your secret is, I'll dig it out of you. I have no secret. You know everything I know. Don't lie to me. I heard you whispering to Mother. I heard you say there was something that could give unspeakable power over all Silvari. What were you talking about? I have to go. I'm traveling to a centaur refuge in the Silver Waste to research Ventari. We'll talk later, Fallon. Elders, I bring grave news. Please, listen. Take a deep breath, sapling. What's your hurry? Small, imp-like creatures. We just wanted to explore beyond Mother's roots. 
They appeared out of nowhere. Asura, I guess. Malamedes had an encounter with them not long ago. He was lucky to survive. Where did they go? They took them northwest into the forest. What was that? I followed oh them a while, goodness. but then I felt I should come get help. They said something about returning to Metrica before I lost their trail. Kaith, Fowlin, you two had the most experience in the wild. Would you scout ahead? The Secondborn are precious. We cannot allow them to be killed to assage some ignorant race's curiosity. At last, something we agree on, Traherne. I can't wait to teach these imps a lesson. You and me, together. We'll rescue as many as we can. They treated Malamedes terribly. I hope they're not so harsh with this group. They're going to remember the day they met the two of us. That was interesting. What happened? What did you see? I was Kaith more than 20 years ago. Fowlin and Traherne were there. The leader of the Nightmare Court? Must have been fascinating to hear how they interacted back then. I'm jealous. Did you learn anything that will help us find Kaith? Saw the destination. Metrica. Metrica province? That area is populated with the Sura. Why are they going there? They were tracking down some imps that kidnapped some of the secondborn. Imps? Alright. Rox is expecting me for sword practice. Yeah, you and that sword. I'd better let her know I won't be there. I w it won't take long. I'll meet you there. Good plan. Be careful. Or, how is Rox with the great sword? Never seen her fight with one. She's surprisingly good, though she says it isn't her weapon of choice. She learned when she was in school. She knows a ton about battle stances. I'm learning a lot. Plan to keep at it. Good plan. Be careful. What's going on, Marjorie? This is the place? It's run by Inquest. We'll have to be careful. I'll watch your back while you're in the vision. Sounds like a plan. You have the memory seeds, right? I do, and I'm certain the target is here somewhere. Let's look around. Use your intuition to find the memory seed location. By intuition, you mean this magical bar. Of course, I'm going to probably kill some Inquest to get through. Now, where'd you come from? Marjorie, you're doing a great job over there. So I'll let you know. Well, help. You were so awesome last mission. So you gotta go this way then? Hmm. On this side. No, over here. Getting warmer. Getting colder. Down here. Hmm. Hello. Ah, here it is. You're right. We need to go in stealthily and see if we can take them by surprise. There are too many of them to attack head on. Hold up a second. Why are you so interested in Cadiern and his dissenters? It's simple, really. From the moment we awakened, our mother has molded us into an idealized version of nobility. She doesn't see or care who we are, so long as we match her ideal of us. I felt it too. The pressure to be perfect. Yes. And the pain that comes with failing to live up to her expectations. Why can't she love us unconditionally? She claims to believe that all weeds and blossoms are equal, yet she tries to make us all into blossoms. I love you, just as you are. We belong together. 
Come on, my darling. Let's go rescue our sprouts. Put your hand on my arm. But if your way fails, we do it my way. Stay close. Sure, I could do that. That's cool. This isn't what I normally play. I don't know what I'm doing. It all makes sense. Wait, now. there's a guard ahead. Take it out from behind. I keep hearing things. Yes, hearing. Not very bright, are you? Great. Now we can get that gate open. Lovely. That imp didn't see a thing, because we took it down first. Now we can get in. What an odd smell. Can someone bring me an Aether Slicer, please? Let's go around this way. Nobody minds. I knocked him out, everyone saw it. Ow, ow, ow. Knock him out. Why can't I knock him out? The donk. That's much easier. Is that area still active? That'll do. Still can't knock that guy out, though. All right, now that we're finally through. Those constructs look like they could detect us if we get too close. So keyword, don't get too close. Don't mind him, just another uh, another construct. Nothing to see here. Unexpected sound registered. Investigating. Log. Query answered. Unexpected sound Internal was door panel. panel. You should be activated when that thing is far away. Registering unexpected noise. In log, deactivating door. Alerting repair team of potential malfunction. Registering unexpected noise. Alert, alert, intruder detected. Why couldn't Kate use a flamethrower?
I win. Sorry, bird. Hello. Sneaky, sneaky. What do you suppose they're doing to them? Bad things. Let me see if I can figure out this console. This. No. Do you see? Bodies. Everywhere. What's taking you so long? Almost got it. They're killing them. We have to go now. Oh, thorns. I can't open it from here. There are two more panels that control this door. Of course there are. I am going to kill every last one of these monsters. We can't go charging in. Our best bet is to sneak in and take them by surprise. Back to work. Break's over. Hmm. Finally, the console's working. I swear, sneeze on that thing and it breaks. My tests on the leaf patterns around the central body produce a fascinating result. What intruder? There's no intruder here. Hit me now. Don't you die. Thank you for dying. You about done there, foul lane? Good. Where's the control panel? Here's the control panel. Beep, bop, boop, boop. Head to the central chamber. Is that back this way? destroy this entire place. What is this? Who let this creature out of its cage? Someone's fire! You monster. You're dead. No. Security! Security! I'll take care of them. Go stealthily and neutralize their leader. These are wacky cables. Where did he go?
Come here, Vorp. Just want to murder you, that's all. Bunk. Oh, almost had me there. Good thing my defense shielding is active. Defense shielding, you say? Yes, one down. Wait, what? No! Cease your attacks! I feel a strong energetic connection between us and those constructs. Oh, you noticed. We've learned that your kind's life force does wonders for our golem's power levels. This stops now. These monsters will pay a steep price for their cruelty. Focus on their leader. Hello, crew? Some reinforcements would be appreciated. Your shields will protect you against the creature's attacks. Now find that creature while I maintain the shield generators. Be anywhere. That generator malfunctioning. I nearly lost my shield. Hmm. Malfunctioning generators, you say. the leader. Why does that take me all the way over there? Skill is useless. You're in the way. I'm more resilient than I appear. It'll take more than that to best me. So persistent. Crew, hook the babbling one up to my golem. Immediately. Stop. Ah! You're surprisingly formidable. But this should re-establish my superiority. Get back here, Warp. I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna murder you. I didn't care anymore. Curse you creatures! The victory will be short-lived, I assure you. Yeah, I'm working on it. Standing in the way. This this is real life. 
pain. Pain, humiliation, and eventually death. For us? And for them. You have to kill them. Me? <laughs> it was all in the interest of knowledge gained. You beings are an anomaly. It wasn't personal. I am going to tear your ears off. You, don't let it get away. No. Where did it go? No! It got away. Forget that monster. It's time to go home. We have to get the injured back to safety. I don't like being bested. I refuse to be anyone's fool. Not these horrible creatures, and certainly not Wynne's. Stop obsessing. By now, Wynne is all the way out in the Silverways. And you're not a fool. Wynne is guarding an important secret. No one person should control our fate, my love. You really think she knows something she's not telling us? I know she does. She said to Mother, they can never know. It could exert unspeakable power over all Silvari. I must know what that power is. Once the Sprouts are safe, you and I are going out to the Silver Wastes to confront her. Once again, interesting. Tell me everything. What happened? What did you see? If Elaine was obsessed with Wynne, she thought Wynne had a secret. What did Kay think of that? She wasn't sure. She didn't hear overhear Wynne and Feltry talking. Well, isn't this just a complex mystery? So where are we going next? Silver Wastes. Find the truth.